Oh, there's a Mr. Gutsy. I must have missed him when I was here last time. Gutsy! I was looking down from here, from up there earlier. It's all come together. So, these were the buildings that I looked at earlier, that I uh, didn't spot because I was too busy being attacked by uh, the Legion. Who, again, haven't attacked me for a while. I've been walking around quite a lot in the wilderness and they uh, they were quite eager. Maybe because I got the NCR to eventually spawn and they came and talked to me and they went away. Because of them, the Legion, maybe there's like a timer or something and it will take a while. Oh, grounds. Oh, there's the texture on the ground going crazy. Good stuff. Good stuff. This is all boarded up. I don't know if I can go in any of these buildings. Hmm. These just for show, are they? Oh, that's a bit boring. I thought I could do something here. Okay, well that's fine. We've got all of these buildings over here to go and explore. So let's go and f f d do that, then. Why don't we? Stay away from Fall on Hope, because, uh... No, that can't be Camp Fall on Hope. Fall on Hope's behind me. So that must be... I'm sure that's an NCR camp, though. Oh. Nope, can't play on the swings. They are... Years of disuse have rusted them solid. Yeah. Anything? No, can't use the merry-go-round. Seesaw. No, it's all rusted. It's all rusted solid. Sorry, Boone. I know you were looking forward to that. Oh, there's a house. There's a house with a door. A train station. Hooray! I'd like a ticket, please. Ooh, I'll take all your pre-war money, though. Why did the train station have all this money just sitting around? How expensive were the trains when the war happened? Then again, they can be much more expensive than uh, the trains are now. Okay, well there's a cursor... I've got two cursors here on my radar which show that there are items, there are buildings, named buildings here. So let's go and explore this one first of all. Oh! It's the fire ants. Our time has come. We would have saved when we left the train station, so I'm good to just run over and try now. Let's go, fire ants. Let's see if you're any bigger than... Well, you're definitely bigger. Nope. Haha. <laughs> I did a... I punched you so hard you did a backflip. Wait, which ones are still alive? Oh, you've got him. There we go. Oh! He's still alive! Sorry, Boone. I thought he was dead. But yeah, sorry, Boone. You know how it is. You, uh... You punch an ant so hard he does a backflip, you just, you just kind of assume he's dead. Ooh. This looks interesting. What have we got here? Ooh, some new metal armor. Ah... Oh. I could take it with me, but it's 30 grams of weight. I could give it a boon. This stupid open mouth. Why are you walking around with your teeth clenched? Oh, you won't carry the Great Khan suit. Okay. He's refusing to carry the Great Khan armor for me. But that's fine. He carried everything else, so I've got a bit of uh, free space. And was that... The Zats did a better... Bigger, uh, better job of kicking my ass than the uh, regular ants do. I suppose that's that comes with being able to breathe fire. Probably. I'm not an expert on ants. Um, I wonder what the word is for an expert on ants. And, okay, this probably can't be an antologist. That would be... That would be incredibly lazy. Oh, who are you? Hello! Who are you? Oh, you're a fiend! Oh. There's no problem killing you. We remember some of you from the, uh... 
uh, the uh, Repcon building. Do you remember Boone? Oh, no, you weren't there with me then. That was before I met you, Boone. We found some dead bodies of these guys at the uh, Repcon Centre. It was lovely. Well, there's lots of places to visit around here. This looks like a building I could go in. Um, I can hear the sounds of something shooting at something, but we seem to be... Hello, fiend. Fiend, hold still. There we go. Oh. The hell just happened? Hi. Was that you guys shooting? You guys okay? When I got this assignment, I was hoping to see more damage. Still standing around smoking. Well, as long as you're not sh shooting at me. That's the important thing there. Not sure what happened there, really. I think I think they were having a fight with each other. And I sort of popped up in the middle of it. Just in time to get exploded by a car. I think that's what happened. Um, okay. I don't know why NCR aren't attacking me. My reputation hasn't... I'm still a sneering punk, which I'm pretty sure is still bad. I'm pretty sure that's still a negative... It must be, because they attacked, they shot at me before, when I was walking down that road. Oh my. Okay. Yeah, well, that super sledge of yours is uh, doing you some good, isn't it? It's not happening. It's, your aim's not brilliant. There you go. Nah. That was what was in here. Two sunset sarsaparilla star bottle caps. And some magazines, I suppose. Ooh, true police stories. That might be a book. No, it's not. It's a magazine. It's just one I haven't seen before. And that was the other one I got. I'm still... I'm not going to risk it. I'm still going to give uh, the NCR areas a, a bit of a wide berth. Because I'm still... I'm still sure that they, they should be attacking us by now. I don't think... I don't understand why they're not. It's really odd. But, uh... There are fiends in this area. Fiends are people that I have no problem killing. Hey, see, there's one. There's a few. Ooh, hang on. Ooh, I know what we can use finally, because they've got energy weapons. Atomic cocktail. We could use them against the fire ants as well, or whatever. Good, then we got them. There's quite a lot of these buildings, just random ones. I think I walked past one earlier. I sort of got close enough to open it, but I got distracted. You ready to die? Are you? Because, uh. You just did! Yeah! What happened there? Where's you? Where are you? I prefer the side of yours! Boom! There's a lot of it! Haha! <laughs> oh! Oh! Nice! You guys suck so, so much. What are you guys doing down here anyway? Boone! I'm over encumbered. Fine by me. This is my uh, process at the moment. Beat up everyone, take all their stuff, give it all to Boone until we find a merchant. And then roll in the money. Oh! Okay. I couldn't. I didn't have a high enough science level to fix it, but I have. Uh, Unlocked a quest. Find the source of the radiation. Vault 34. Right, okay. That's uh, that's that answer then. Um, I think Vault 34... Uh, who was from Vault 34? It might be the fiends that are from Vault 34, actually. I was trying to remember... Who said that they were... It was either... 
I wonder if Doc Mitchell said he was from Vault 34 as well. Maybe Doc Mitchell used to be a fiend. And then he uh, gave up the life to become the Doctor of Good Springs. I mean, I suppose I could just keep walking around and punching fiends. That seems to be netting me some good karma, at least. And these guys aren't really providing me with much of a... Uh, well, providing me with much resistance at the moment. I see I'm neutral with them at the moment, but I'm sure I'm supposed to be not neutral. Oh, still, give the area a wide berth. It might wear off, and uh, I don't want Boone going cr going crazy and just attacking people and then blaming me for it again. Yeah, I can hear you smack talking me, but I can't see you. I think you're on the other side of the building. You down here? Where are you? Look, I'll happily fight you. There you are. Hi. I'm. S Excuse me. I'm in the middle of something. Is he? Or did you kill him? Good job, Boone. Oh no, you, you didn't kill him. Okay, bad Boone. Alright, you've made up for it now. You, you killed him that time. I saw that. South Vegas Ruins entrance. Uh, South Vegas Ruins East entrance. Okay. Yeah. Let's check out the South Vegas Ruins. These must be the ruins south of Vegas. Or, possibly the ruins of Vegas, but the southernmost ruins. Either way, I'm sure there'd be something in here we can punch. And that's all I need. That's really the only justification I need to come in here. Yep, yeah, there we go. Fiends. Haha! -ha! I'm jumping. Ah, sorry, Boone. Sorry. you got to be careful when you run at me like that. Well, that was uh, not quite an intense battle, but uh, it was certainly a battle. I mean, there's no denying that. People died. Most of the... All, all of the people who died were, were, were not us. Um, they were men. They were women. There were quite a lot of women. I, didn't re I don't remember the fiends being mostly women. But, um... I guess they were. Hmm. It's a good job I have the Lady Killer perk. Because I think I have the Lady Killer perk. If I don't have the Lady Killer perk, maybe I should get the Lady Killer perk. I'm about to hit level 14, I think, so... Uh... Well, when I do, I can check and see if I have it. But there are other perks that I want more than that, actually, so that would explain why I don't have it if I don't. I heard the little shudder he when I when I push him, you know uh what's the what would be the right word for this? Pump? Pump him full, yeah. When I pump him full of my stuff. There's no way that could be taken to mean any other meaning. When I pump him full of my stuff, it's nice it, it's a, that weird little uh, this does sound wrong now. I pump him full of my stuff, he does a little shudder. There's just no way of saying that and it does it, it sounds wrong. Ah! Right. There were some traps. There were a, a few traps. Uh. Ah. Oh, come on, I was all the way over here! <sighs> okay. I know I didn't have the repair required to, um... To disable that trap, so all I could do is really just set it off. I've got quite a few doctor's bags, though, so... Boom! There are mines down there. For some reason, they're not saying that. I suppose it's their own mines, so... Yeah, let them come closer. I mean, if you want to run down there and set them all off for me, Boone, so it's safe, I'm happy, but... F 
Fall back, Boone. You're wounded. Eat this. Still one up there. I got this, Boone. You stay back. Not good enough. Whew. Well, that was some resistance they put up, wasn't it, Boone? How are you for health? You seem alright now. There must be some pretty good stuff in it. I'm glad you didn't die, Boone. Oh, just because you've got so much stuff on you at the moment, I wouldn't be able to take any of it. Uh, yeah. That's some good loot right there. Take some cigarettes. Lovely. <laughs> uh, I've never noticed that before. Because I've because he got all blown up. Or there was only blown his legs and his head off. I've taken the metal armor off of him, so his body's become naked, but his legs still have the metal armor attached to them. Gonna be up. Okay, he's reached his limit of how much he can carry, so I might have to leave and come back and sell all this stuff to someone. Also means finding someone in the waste who will actually buy stuff from me. Okay. Wiped out all the fiends around here. I've gone back and emptied out all of Boone. He is now completely empty. Washed and clean. He's very happy about that. Uh, stocked up on a few things. I should probably heal and uh, drink myself up. There we go. Now, on to probably what is my, my favourite parts of all of the Fallout games. We're going to do our first vault. Vault 3. Let's do this. on your ass. Now what? Now what? Yeah. You've got nothing, have you? you got nothing. Oh, this is going to be a boom. This is going to be a cake. Oh, I picked up too much stuff. I can't cake walk anywhere. Hang on. Boom, I'll be with you in a second. How are you getting on? Yeah. I think Boone can handle this. Well, there's a lot of his house quite low. But, uh... I don't care. Hey, you leveled me up, Boone. Good job. All right, it's over. Good stuff. Okay, I want more points in survival. Uh, I'll tell you for why. Because I want to craft the better armor, and I need more points in survival. So I'm going to go for that for the time being. Oh, well, our level 14 perks. Uh, you do 50% with melee and unarmed against sentries. Night stalkers. I don't know what night stalkers are. They're not sentries, are Spore plants, spore carriers. I think, yeah. Deathclaw, super mutants, and feral ghouls. 50% melee and unarmed. De yeah, that's quite good. Your limbs only see 50% of the damage they normally would. That's also good. Ah, oh, this is the problem. This is the problem with the perks. They're all quite good, aren't they? Um, but I think purifier. Yeah. I think death claws especially because we have to run up to them. If you've got guns, you can kind of kite a death claw a little bit. You can run away from it, and uh... yes, thank you. You can kind of run away from it a little bit and kite it and just pick it off a little bit of time. When you've got to run up and punch it... Okay, last time I knocked it down quite quickly and uh, it wasn't much of a problem. But that, I can't always rely on that to happen, so... You guys only have really one insult, don't you? Do you like the sight of your own blood? I mean... There's quite a lot of you. Maybe work together, come up, maybe hire someone to come up with some more impressive... I suppose, if you kill most of the people you see, 
you could probably use the same one-liner against all of them, couldn't you? You'd just be like, you know, it doesn't matter, does it? Because they're going to die. But it's, it's embarrassing when you get in a situation like this, where I, I murder all of you. Uh, that's a milk bottle. And, you know, you just, you just look incompetent then. I suppose you don't care, though. You're dead. Um, so I suppose it's it's a moot point, really. What was I saying? Death claws. Yeah. When you've got an enemy that can run up to you. Oh. When you've got an enemy that can run up to you and smack you. You want to be able to do oh, as much damage to it as possible. When you've got an enemy that can shoot at you. When they're close range, they kind of become a bit... Um, ooh. Yes, please. Yeah, I almost thought you'd maybe put the Ripper on, but he's happy with his uh, his sword. So yeah, when you've got these dudes with guns and you run up close to them and punch them, they're rendered a bit silly. But when you've got a guy, like when you've got something like a Deathclaw which can run up to you and uh, they can do quite a lot of damage, you want to do damage against them. And that's why I took the perk. Oh, oh, hang on, something's wrong. I'm getting a lot of vibration on my controller and I can't see what's doing it. Uh, I mean, hang on. Boon, um, fight them for a bit. I'm in a bit of trouble. I'm in a, a spot of bother, one might say. One might say. There we go. Let's let that recover for a little bit. Oh, no. I just decided to come and... Stop backing away! Okay, there is that issue where you're running at them and they back away from you at the same speed that you chase after them. That doesn't happen very often, though. Boon, where have you gone? You're supposed to be protecting me from these things. Or at least, you know, getting in the way of their bullets. Thank you. Sorry, Boone, I killed them all. You're as, uh... You continue to be as useless as always. Boone, where are you? Oh, there he is. Disappeared from my map for a second there. I got a tiny bit worried. Only because I'd have to carry all the stuff. Well, no, I can't carry all of the stuff that he's uh, he's got with him, so... Oh, uh, no! Oh, oh! I betrayed my feelings. Boone died. I've lost Boone's spot apart. You killed Boone! I forgot, oh, uh, that's Boone's, that's probably Boone's quest, isn't it? I forgot to remember to forget. Boone, where are you? Boone? Where are you, Boone? Oh, Boone. Boone, Boone, Boone. This is not a great... Uh, this is not the grave for you. Oh, my friend. I mean, you, in fairness, you did quite a good job. I don't know how many of these I killed, but... Yeah, you did quite well. Clear this pool table off. Not gonna let... let you let, Not gonna let you lie on the floor, Boone. With the rest of these animals. I need your arms. Uh, can you let? There we go. I need your arm. Ow! I am trying to mourn my friend. Don't come and punch me in the back, you jerk. Yeah. You've got whiskey, though. I can almost sort of forgive you slightly. Honestly, these guys are just impolite. Okay, I suppose I've murdered quite a lot of their friends. So maybe they, uh... Maybe they don't really care too much about me letting me groove. But still... Okay, Boone, I can't, um... I was going to position you in something in a slightly more... Uh... Peaceful position than just lying there. But, um, I think this really this suits you better. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to take the dog... Oh, God, look at all this stuff he's got with him. I can't take anywhere. I'm going to have to take the dog hat back off of you. And, uh... You can keep the sunglasses. You can keep the patrol armor. I'm not... I'm not going to let you, uh... Lie there naked. Oh, all this stuff I can't... You never did drink that beer, did you? Oh, I'm going to have to take it back. All oh, this stuff I can't take with me. Oh, Boone. This is where we part ways. You were mostly useless. You, you carried my stuff for me. And you acted as a good meat shield when I needed it. Uh, like then, I would have been in trouble, I think. 
Possibly. I could have run away, I suppose. Um, you've hurt my reputation with the NCR. That's That was kind of a dick move. But, uh... So long, old friend. But I say old. We've known each other for about a week. <sighs> okay, let's murder the rest of these dudes then, I guess. Okay, I might be a little bit stuck here. Um, the only door that goes anywhere is this one. And I tried to open it and I broke the lock. And I broke the two locks back there as well. I don't see anywhere else I can go. That just takes me up to the... Yeah, back up there again. I was just up there. And there's nothing up there. Um, oh, I suppose it's down here. We haven't been here yet. Oh no, this is just a different... Okay. They're still here. Yeah, we haven't been here. Oh great, I, I, lot, I managed to break all the doors, but at least I can open this medical pack. That's one thing, I suppose. I really like the vaults. Um, oh, okay. Um, it's probably my favourite thing in Fallout, is the vaults. Just finding them, and then finding out what the each experiment in the vault was. If you're not familiar with the vaults, basically what happened is, is... The Vault Tech Company, which is the company that uh, built all the vaults, as you might expect from the name, they hmm. they made each of the vaults into well, not all of the vaults. They made most of the vaults uh, into social experiments. Very few of the vaults actually worked as designed. Um, the 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 design for the vaults is supposed to stay still for 20 years, open up, and you were then supposed to use your Garden of Eden creation kit, or GEC, to terraform the radioactive... Ah, there we go. The radioactive post-apocalyptic world outside of the vault. And there were a few places that did this, and that, that worked out fine. There's a place called, I think, Vault City, in one of the early... I, can't remember, I think it might be Fallout 2? Um, where they did exactly that, and they had a flourishing um, civilization and worked out all nicely. Most of the rest of the results all had some sort of thing, basically. It was a social experiment and to. Nope. To basically just mess around with them. See, one of, the, one of them was. I'm going to try to think of the ones that aren't in this game. Because uh, I probably will end up doing all the vaults. One of them had a cloner. Uh, I didn't kill this guy, did I? Huh. Oh, okay. That's that's what did that. Right, right. I see you. Oh come on! I was I was. I was nowhere near! Ah! It just healed my limbs. It's a good job this place has loads of stim packs all over the place, because I'm using them up pretty quickly. Right. I was nowhere near that trap. I, I'm annoyed that I still got hurt by it, uh, even though I managed to see it. Alright, that is the recreation area. I don't want to go there yet. So yeah, one of the vaults had a cloning device, and they cloned this guy called Gary, who might have been the overseer, it's not clear. Over and over and over and over and over again. But each Gary became more stupider and more violent with each iteration. And so eventually the vault became filled with murderous, idiot Garys that could only say the word Gary over and over. So you're just basically going through the vault and all of the vault residents are just, just, this guy, just basically Gary number 7 or Gary number 52. And all they do is run at you and shout, Gary, Gary. Um, it's wonderful. Uh, it's uh, one of the more memorable vaults. And there were other vaults where they did other things like they kept... Hello? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that's Carter's. Carter's course. Okay, I thought maybe I'd accidentally hit one of you guys through the wall. But by the judging by the fact that that's called Carter's corpse, um, I'm guessing he was dead before I got here. Woo! 
Uh, I, I will help you in a second. I'm guessing I can't probably open this door anyway. Yeah, it's locked hard. I need a key. Uh, do these guys have a key? I think I killed... I'm going to search for the bodies, but there might have been... Yeah, these fiends generally aren't really that hard. I can kill them in a few punches, but they are fairly numerous. That's the problem. Some of the vaults had less interesting... Um, experiments like one of them was designed never to open um, and it's basically the the overseer the, each of the vault had an overseer by the way uh, that oversaw the vault as the name would suggest yeah take a vault three jumpsuit we don't like those the overseer was the only one ah where did you come from I don't like the sight of my own blood stop asking me could you could you maybe... Oh, I suppose I keep killing them so they can't do it. I should tell one of them that I don't like seeing the sight of my own blood. And he can go around and tell all the rest of them. Maybe pass the message along. Because it's getting tiresome being asked the same questions over and over again. You know that? It's just outright tiresome. So yeah. I will finish this. Uh, the Overseer was the only one who knew that the vault... That the outside was fine. But he would basically lie to the rest of the people living there to say... No, no, we, uh, it's, um, uh, it's, it's all radioactive outside, we can't leave. And so people go, oh, okay, I suppose we'll just, uh, we'll just stay here forever then. And he goes, yeah, yeah. The vault in, uh, Fallout 3 at the start was, I think, like that. And then they let a dude in, uh, which was your dad, in, and then they let you out, which was you. And then you do all the things in Fallout 3. Uh, this vault... I don't actually remember what happened. I think basically the fiends came and killed everyone. I don't... Oh, it's all flooded. Oh, I wonder if I can drain that. Um, ah! Stop asking me! Okay, Daniel. You're named, so maybe you've got something good on you. Ah, Christ. Learn a new question! Seriously, it's getting real old. Hey, the key, there we go. And the Vault 3 maintenance key. Thank you, Daniel. Got everything I need. The best thing about the vaults is trying to figure out what happened in each one. Most of them are empty, uh, or the occupants are hostile. Very rarely will you find a friendly vault. There is one in this game, uh, spoilers, um, in New Vegas. Uh, that was underneath. I don't know why, it's just underneath the Vegas Strip. Uh, we'll go there at some point. It'll be a while before we go to New Vegas, I, sh I will, fair warning. And there is a reason why I don't want to go to New Vegas, and I should tell you for why when we get there. But it's basically because there's a certain thing. Oh, did you OD? Oh, silly thing. That's, see, this is, this is why drugs are for winners. No, no, that's obviously the thing that I've been saying. Uh, winners don't do drugs. Yeah. They do drink lots of beer, though. Let's hammer this message home. We'll just keep saying it. Hello. Did you overdose as well? No, I don't, I don't want to sleep on the next to the OD. Okay, I think I've explored the whole of the residential area, other than the sections underwater. I'll either need to... Yeah, I'll either need to drain that somehow, or get come back with a rebreather. Good news! I have a key. You're all free! Take down this password. It'll get you into the overseer's area upstairs, I think. Thank you, Rick Lancer! We'll find our own way out. Do you want to take any of these guns? Weapons or anything that might help you? No? no who have we got? Dennis? Rachel? Thanks for the help. No worries. Thank you for releasing us. It's alright. Ah, it's nice. It's nice when you see, when they've got better names than just, you know, like Settler or something. It makes you think that those three must be like a group or party or something that have been exploring the wasteland together. 
And they must have some sort of deep and rich backstory. There's Carter. Oh, poor Carter. They're probably related to a mission, actually. There's probably a mission to come here and release them. Um, and, you know, report back and take, oh, Carter's dead. Sorry. Yeah. I uh, I could lie and say I tried to help him, but he was dead when I got here. You guys see yourself out there. Go to the recreation area. Aha, I saw this one. <laughs> now, you got any more traps? Yes, you do. Uh, ooh, hang on. There's a non-hostile in here. What's this? Hello. Hello, Bryce Anders. How the hell did you get in here? And who the hell are you? I'm the Punch Monkey. Uh, uh okay. What can you tell me about this place? What are, what are you doing here? Tell me why I should tell you anything. I don't know you. All right. I guess I'll just leave you here then. This was Vault Three. I'm sure you can tell that by all the the fiends are degenerate drug addicts who, who are the fiends I've been murdering all these people Is, are they the thing are they the fiends sure oh thank God none of them stopped to tell me who they are they all just kept coming out at me and asking me about my blood it's really weird I think there might be a cult I think either the drugs have done something to their brain or they're some sort of weird cultist thing the fiends killed everyone living here now they're yeah that's it yeah they basically vault three opened their doors and the fiends murdered everyone. Uh, make yourself. Okay, uh, Bryce. Um, do you not want my help? Why the fuck are you back? Mm, I guess not. Okay, well. Uh, well, you'll be happy to know that I have dis disabled all your traps and killed all of the. fiends here, so you can leave if you want to. I'm not going to stop you, but if you don't want my help then screw you then. Okay. Vault 3 is haunted. Um, I have to go this way because this is a straight corridor. Why is there a floating corpse in the middle of the room? That is... Hello? Oh, oh a lot of things. It's a headless corpse. Okay. Full... Oh. oh it's, it's like it's stuck on something. It's swinging. Alright, well this is... Uh... This is certainly a new one in terms of is as far as uh, Fallout glitches go. I've never seen that before. Would you would you like your head back? If I, if I just will that appease you? No. Is this? Ah, this is the overseer's room. This is what he gave me the password for. And the dino toy here. I like this. Uh, lots of beer. Good. Chinese training manual, good. Oh, I'm, I'm over encumbered with beer. Might have been the Chinese training manual. I can use that. That's, that increases stealth if memory serves. Sneak, sneak, stealth, same thing. There we go. I've drunk a few beers. Loot, loot, wait. That doesn't make any sense though. If the beer is keeping me, I suppose I suppose I get rid of the bottles afterwards. Just thinking, if the beer is weighing you down, drinking the beer is, is still going to be... Ooh, man with magazines. You're still going to be as heavy. I suppose it doesn't quite work like that. And as you say, you do dispose of the bottles, and I suppose the bottles are a small part of the weight. Now, is this an area... is this a new area? This looks like... yeah, these doors... none of these doors are open, are they? Ah! This would be the overseer's room, then, I guess. What can we do in here? Activate overseer's terminal. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Uh, kind of skimmed over that, but sounds like 
there was a new overseer who I think it was uh, they, the old overseer didn't want to go outside and the new overseer did and the new overseer won the election to uh, go outside and uh, everyone went outside that's the gist of that if I read that terminal right, the room I opened, the storage rooms, are submerged. So I've opened them, but I can't go down and get them yet. Yep, dead fiends. I've probably been through here. Oh, this is the entrance. I picked up a key. So maybe I can open one of these doors I broke. Haha, -ha, there we go. See, so yeah, I, think, I think I have to give up on those other doors. Ah! <laughs> I put, yeah, I came up with a power fist. I punched the power fist off of him. Nice. What was it? it was a it was a brave try. Um, seriously, you know, a for effort. More people to punch. I saw red. That looks like more people to punch. Hello. You're more people to punch. Oh, and you're guarding a locked door. Ah! You're another person to punch. Drop the flamer. There we go. Ha. You like the sight of your own oh, she... like the sight of your own you, you, you Look, you just... She, you heard her ask it that time, okay? Now you're just being stupid. I think the drugs have rotted these guys' brains. Look, you literally just heard her ask it. You didn't even wait for me to answer. And then you ask me. Wrong with you people. I can hear dogs barking in there, so I've got dogs! <gasps> Who's got dogs? You've got dogs! How the hell did you get in here? Where the fuck are my guards? <laughs> I just killed these dogs. How the hell did you get in here? Just run in, punch both of his dogs in the face, and it's like, what? What? Oh, I. Uh, oh, I could take a magazine and try and beat the speed check on him. Oh, it's on now. Is it? Your, the, the things you say and your actions seem to uh, suggest otherwise. I've killed your dogs. I've killed all of your men. Um, why would I want to pass a speech check with him? I've killed everyone else in this in this vault. I freed all his prisoners. Reverse pulse cleaner. Oh, that might be probably for a quest or something. I'll take that. Weightless. Hmm. Well, you better get out of here. Well, he almost threatened me that time. Well, he, he did threaten me to get out of here. But then he took his ri ripper off, did a little boogie, and then uh, put it back again. I put I put my fists down. I've backed out. What are you gonna do? You better get out of here. <laughs> you better think twice about that. <laughs> Just did a little jig every time I run up to him. You don't belong here. You better think twice about that. You gonna ask me about my blood? Get the fuck out of here. You better get out of here. No, he's not gonna ask me about my blood. You thought you could hide from me? Again, I'm not hiding. I ran up to you. I've been running up in front of you. I, I haven't gone anywhere. You peep. <sighs> oh, I failed a quest. Oh. Well, I'm sure it wasn't that important. Uh, da, 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 da. Motor runner's helmet. Melee weapons plus five. Uh, yeah, we'll take that, I suppose. We'll take the ch Ooh, actually, we might not take the chainsaw. It's quite heavy. If it was a unique chainsaw, I might make... Uh, I might make uh, space for it, but it's not, so... Now who's king of the fiends, huh? Huh? I'll give you two hints. It's Punch Monkey. That wasn't a hint, was it? Hmm. 
Well, I thought he might have a key or something on him that might be able to open these other doors around here, but I guess not. Um, oh, I suppose I'm in the maintenance wing. Maybe if I had better, I don't know, science or just understanding of computers, I could maybe drain the water in the uh, lower sections of the vault. But uh, I don't, so I can't. Maybe if I ever come back here, Boone, for uh, that Anders guy, I think that's his name. But wasn't Anders the dude I killed? I'm feeling there was a guy called Anders. Oh, wait, hang on. Where am I supposed to be going? Uh, Boone. I have a feeling Anders was the name of the guy I, guy I killed on the crucifix by the... Oh, here we go. By the ranger camp. That seems right. I guess maybe there's two Anders in this game. I suppose that's not too unbelievable a thing to to happen. There being two two people called Anders in the world. Hmm. But whatever. If I get if I get sent back to um, to rescue him or whatever, maybe someone will give me that mission. I will make sure my uh, lockpick is better by the time I come back, so that I can open those doors and. Uh, We'll find out, I guess. So that was Vault 3. Um, a lot of things. We lost Boone. We uh, didn't gain very much, I'm going to be honest. I got a lot of stim packs, but I spent them killing all the fiends. Uh, I killed a lot of fiends. So that was quite good. Um, and here we are, back in the wasteland. On our own. I don't know what to do now. Um... Oh, yeah, I would keep calling Camp Macau and Camp uh, Forlorn Hope. Forlorn Hope's all the way over here. Um, that, I think that's the place where they shot at me earlier when I tried to walk over from uh, Novak. I came down there and they shot at me, so, yeah, because it's that sort of area. Uh, well, Camp Macau are angry at us. I don't want to do another vault straight away. Crimson Caravan... Apparently, share the NCR repetition. I feel like I could head towards Raoul's shack. I need a new companion. And I'm in the area. Yeah. Let's. Alright, I'll place. Yeah. Let's head towards Raoul. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed that, why not watch some of my other videos? And if you've already seen all of them, don't worry, I bring out new ones every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, so you're never far away from another video. And if you really like them, you could subscribe. And if you really, really like them, you could follow me on Twitter at JackmanPlays. That's it for now. Till next time, citizens. Jackman out.